Well guys, I can't believe it, the time has finally arrived. We have finished with the van conversion, so let me take you through a couple of features that I added over the last few days. So now, underneath the kitchen is the same as, la same as last time, but what we've added is an Outwell uh, 24 litre cool box, which is super, super useful. Um, it comes with a bunch of connections, so like you can either plug into 240 mains or into uh, a cigarette lighter port on your uh, electric control panel. But what I'm going to do is wire it up and add a cable so that it links up to just directly up to my kit and then I can switch it on and off when I need to. Now I've added a couple of extra things. I've got a fire blanket down here and a dehumidifier down there. I've also added a carbon monoxide reader just in case. So we've got the bed set up in the back now, which is really nice. It's super cozy back there. We spent a night in the van recently um, and it was actually quite warm. It wasn't, we didn't need any extra heating or anything like that, even though it is the start of November. Um, and we woke up feeling absolutely great. I think one of the most important things that we added were curtains. Now this makes such a big difference because in the evening, the light from inside means that people outside can see in quite easily, even though the windows are heavily tinted. What I think is most important is, as time goes, the camper will develop with us as we travel. Uh, things will change, maybe stuff will get modified, stuff might move around, and who knows, it might look completely different in six months. Um, it's just the way that it develops to suit your needs. One thing you guys may have noticed is that we've removed the overhead storage bit. Now, the reason I did this was because it wasn't, I didn't seem to be developing it any further and I didn't really like the look of it. And it was more annoying than it was useful. So uh, for the moment, it's come out until I can think of a better design to go up there or something else to go somewhere else. But I think instead of having that, I'd rather have some food storage nearer the door.